just uh, checking in with us. And concerns continue over those growing TSA lines all across the nation. It's an issue that may only get worse as a record number of people get ready to fly this summer. News 8's Brian Spiros joins us live from Bradley International Airport with some ways to save yourself some time as you go through security. Good morning, Brian. Good morning, Keith. You know, at some airports across the country, the wait time to get through security upwards of 90 minutes. Even this past weekend at Chicago's O'Hare Airport, people were in line for three hours. Taking a look now at the security line here at Bradley, it's not bad at all. It has gone down significantly from what it was about an hour ago. And whether you're flying out of Bradley or any of the other airports across the country, there are some ways that you can make the process a little smoother going through security. First, book a flight during off-peak times. Basically, anything that's not in the early morning or late afternoon, early evening, your experience will be much faster. Take your jacket, belt, and shoes off while standing in line shortly before you get up to security. The same if you have a laptop, have it out of your bag. Make sure your carry-on is packed appropriately, no more than three ounces of liquid or anything that's going to force agents to search your bag and hold up production for everyone. To avoid the long lines altogether, there's also the TSA pre-check. It costs $85 to enroll and is good for five years. It allows you to go through security much faster, but it may not be an option for everyone. It's a bit pricey if you don't fly a lot. It's $85 for five years. And if you fly maybe once every two years, is it really worth it? If you have a family of four or five, that's a lot of money to just beat the crowds. The recommendation now to show up to the airport at least two hours before a domestic flight. If you're flying international, you want to get here three to four hours before the flight. Keep in mind that while things certainly are running smoothly here at Bradley, that is not the case at airports across the country. So you definitely want to plan accordingly. We are reporting live this morning from Bradley Airport. I'm Brian Spiros. We'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Brian. Thank